Okay, let's do a hard reset for this Nokia 2V and also it might apply the same with the Nokia 3V. I have to find out and leave you a comment in the comment section. Okay, uh, first the phone must be powered off and it has to be connected on your USB um, charging cable from wall charger or a computer. And you have to make sure that the battery is showing in, in the screen that is charging, okay? And um, it's important that you know your Google account associated with the phone because after the factory reset, you have to confirm or verify Google in order, in order to proceed and get to the home screen. And also everything uh, stored in the phone will be deleted. So like pictures, videos, contacts, and um, just with the same Google account. After the factory reset, you will be able to retrieve any information. Okay, this purpose is to, to remove any password, pattern, or pin blocking the screen of the phone. Or you just find trying to sell the phone uh, as a secure way to remove any personal information. Okay, with the phone power off, you're going to press volume up and power key at the same time. And uh, um, after the Android logo appears, you're uh, going to keep continue holding until you're going to get the... Uh, a green uh, robot uh, Android they want to release both keys okay all right so you're ready uh, let's go in press volume up and power key at the same time okay now press okay continue holding both keys Okay, there you go. So now, uh, with the robot on the screen, we're gonna press the volume key. So you're gonna press the volume down and power key at the same time. And this finger has to be ready to press the volume up. Okay, and you need to press this volume up properly in order to turn. And then you wanna, as soon as appear uh, on the screen, a uh, menu with blue letters, then release volume down and power key immediately, okay? Ready, volume down and power key, and then get ready on this one after. Okay, so volume down and power key. Now, press volume down, up, I'm sorry, up. There you go. Now, release both uh, keys when you see this uh, menu appears. Okay, using volume down, you wanna highlight and select wipe data factory reset using volume down. Wipe data factory reset, press the power key, it's going to be your enter OK. Um, volume down, highlight yes, and press the power key. And this is to make sure that you know your Google account associated with the phone, like I said before, because after the factory reset, you had to confirm and verify Google in order to proceed and get to the home screen, OK? So make sure that you know that information. And uh, you agree with this, just press the power key. And here the phone will start uh, deleting and formatting phone. Just press power key when reboot system automatically is highlighted and then it is done. Okay, so here it's gonna take us some five to eight minutes for the phone to properly um, reboot and take us to the initial setup screen where we are going to uh, register language and uh, register the phone under an account with Verizon existing account or new account number okay so just uh, saying there it's gonna take a five to ten minutes <coughs> Okay, just in case that uh, this takes longer than five minutes or eight minutes, that means something is wrong with the phone. Um, the motherboard might, might be might have to be calibrated, such as long press the power key to power off the phone, and then start over again, uh, pressing the volume uh, up and power key as we did at the beginning of the video, in in order. And do another hard reset. You can do the hard reset up to eight times if possible and until you get the motherboard get calibrated and 
have your phone uh, reboot properly and also if you experience a lot of drop calls or uh, drop calls or your phone get freeze this is a good um, option to calibrate the motherboard okay so we are on the initial setup screen of this phone such as follow the steps to program the phone and add it to an existing or new account on Verizon and you're ready to go that's thanks so much for watching my video subscribe to my channel and let me know if you have any other questions and thank you for visiting